to Hi. my channel. Holly is with me because we've had to just escape the house and film this intro because obviously Brandon has no mm -hmm. idea. It is his birthday tomorrow and I decided this year to do something different and I'm surprising him with a holiday to Dubai. So it is Tuesday tomorrow and we go on Friday. So he's actually oh got nervous. Wednesday, Are you Thursday. A bit yeah, I've literally felt so anxious the last week and i'm nervous about like people spilling it so like i'm so glad like, i'm so excited to tell him like i could not have like waited like six Any months longer. Like, yeah I'm telling him tomorrow so mm. i've actually planned this like scavenger hunt for him so me and laura sat down the other day and i've done loads of clues like all over um main zone our area which leads to the last clue which will be at our house and then my friend coral who does all our balloons has set like this massive thing up in the house so he'll literally have his last clue go to the house and it'll be like dubai written in massive letters so oh, my God. oh i literally feel sick to my stomach but also he keeps going on about to buy like how much is he saying oh, oh my to god buy. all the time and it's like, in his, he has to go kind of thing yeah like, he, he's gonna love it when he's there yeah so i'm tuesday and then he's got wednesday thursday oh my god Aaron, two he's, days oh my god Aaron, he's gonna think it's like in a month's time or so, something that's what i mean so i won't tell him at first he'll be like oh my god we're going to dubai like when we go oh, and i'll be like two days and he'll be like where are we staying i'll be like atlantis like he's gonna be so excited so anyway that's the plan me and holly just heading to tesco it is bank holiday monday so most things are sharp we're just gonna have a drive around and just try and see but i want to go to the express yeah anyway i feel so nervous i feel so <laughs> sick and not only that we got back from spain like last week and Ooh, i'm really sniffly from the plane are you already like secretly packing like some stuff well i haven't unpacked my suitcase or unpacked mm. my hand luggage but he's like unpacked all his suitcase i've had to wash all of his summer clothes like, oh, whatever, but it's been awful it's what I mean. like, i've been so stressed because like i can't talk to him about it Jesus either I'm, like Christ. i've had to book pcr i've had to book travel insurance and i've had to i've been checking my emails making sure that he's not got any emails which i know he hasn't but anyway i'm a bit sniffly from the plane i've done a covid test because obviously we have to have a pcr to go and i'm negative back? well i do a pcr on thursday mm -hmm. but like obviously like because i've been snotty i'm like so worried it's covid but i know it's not covid i know that i'm just snotty from the plane and also i think i've got hay fever yeah so that's the plan guys sorry for the really long intro but we're heading to tesco now hopefully just to find that couple like chocolates and stuff like that so i'll update you guys in the morning hey and welcome back to my channel. So for today's video, I am joined with the king. It's his birthday, the birthday today. boy. He is 24 today. But um, yeah, quick disclaimer: I have got a cold, that's why I sound a bit banged up. But Get today me, we are doing our annual. Well, I got my boyfriend for presents. his birthday. <laughs> so yeah, I'm basically just going to give him all his presents. He's going to open them, and yeah. I'm excited. Are you ready for your presents? I think so. Okay. Well. well I've done it a little bit different this year. Oh, it's going to be a treasure hunt, isn't it? Oh, um, no, what are we but doing? But I wanted to do it a bit different this year and make it more oh, fun. Oh, no. So, I want you to take your camera with you. Oh. And Holly's going to come with you. So, I just thought we do the same thing every year. So, I thought <clears throat> yeah. I'll make it a little bit different this year. So, Holly's going to come with you and you're going to go downstairs in your car. And on your car, there's something for you to read. What? Yeah, basically, just head downstairs and basically go and get in your car. <laughs> That's so weird. Yeah, so you and Holly are going to have to go somewhere. Holly's going to help you, basically. And oh, just for moral support, but I want moral support. What am I doing? Okay, that's you ready? Amazing. I think so. Okay. I'm a bit scared now. What? Off you go. <laughs> Clue number one. You can use your phone and do some googling, by the way. For you. Is it a hospital or something? Right, let me google it. You can use your phone throughout, okay? Just google, just search that. You yeah, need to think it. back to your childhood. Do you know the address of the house you lived in when you were born? Where's so that? Drive there. Yeah, I'm not helping you anymore now. Is that where you lived? I don't know. That's where you went when you were born. Oh. That's where you went home when you were first born. Right, right, oh, you've no, got to I take the camera now. I can't help you anymore. This so. is so weird. I don't get it. So we've got to drive to this location, which is the place where I was born. Obviously, I'm not going to say it on camera. God knows what's there. Let but me put, do you know where it is? Where, I don't know. No, where it put it inside. I know where it is. Okay, we're going to... Right, nine minute drive. I'm so confused, guys, because uh, this is literally Erin's presence to me, but she's she's taken to me this... Well, and you she's have not to coming. Drive. <laughs> I've got to drive to this destination. I don't I don't get what's going on. Anyway, right, we'll I'll go back to you guys. Wanna... You're there. Well, do you need to film the journey and like no, all that? No, no. We'll update you guys when we get there. Right, we are just coming in. I have no idea where I am. What? This is so weird. I have no idea if I'm looking out for anything or... Yeah, like where are you meant to be looking? I don't know. I don't know what I'm looking for. Oh, it's there. Clue what? two. I can see it there. No, you've got to get it. And then you've got to read it. It's there. Look. Mate, this is so weird. Two elderlies were shacked up at 21, but you were number 13. Where we used to live. Okay. There's I went there. another road where we used to live. I lived there when I was a baby. Oh. So we're going to another house where we used to live. It's not far from here. 
No. So we'll update you guys when we get there. Right, oh, we're gonna find the slip. Nice and easy. Oh, but it's Danny anyway. I don't get it. I don't want to look weird. You haven't Where's looked very well. Oh, hang on. Where's the road sign, Hans? I'm oh. gonna have a look at the other end of the road, not necessarily where the house is. Ah, oh, it's there, Lynn. Oh, I can't show you, Just show but me. she Just... slotted it in between like fence of where the thing is. There's me looking like a weirdo outside these houses, and it's and at it's the fair. start of the road. That's the next one gonna be. So far, they've all been houses. Shaking hands wasn't always your fault. But beating your dad in a running race was. I, I get the first bit, it's probably related to football, but the beating your dad in a running race. What? As kids. Mate, why are these so hard? They said it's community place, but. I told you that. I don't ever remember not shaking hands with someone there. Right, we're going to another destination. Let's hope the clues get easier. So, guys, the last thing you saw was Brandon going off with Holly on his first clue. So, me and Jess have actually come back to mine and Brandon's house because this is where the final prize is. It looks so good in here. I'm gonna show you guys what Brandon will walk into when he comes back, so. Congratulations, you have only have 48 hours left to go because obviously we go in 48 hours. So, he'll come in, he'll be like, what? And this says, your prize is in the palm of your hand. So obviously it's just through this door, but the palm, I tried to like do a little pun, so see if he gets it. So as he walks in, this is what he'll see. Ta-da! Goodbye. Oh my God. And then I got this cake done, and then we just got some like plates, party poppers, some cups and stuff, and then me and Jess have got party cannons. Should we do that? I just think it'll go like all over the cake. It'll go everywhere. Should we just do one? Maybe we'll just do one, but yeah. So this is what he'll see when he comes in. Obviously, my friend Coral has done all this for us. And um, so we've got the Dubai in the letters, and then she's done all these ceiling balloons. And then yeah, obviously we've got the cake and stuff. And then she made this little orb that says, happy 24th birthday, Brandon. And yeah, honestly, I'm so excited for him to come in and see it. Like he'll literally have no idea. Like none of the clues on the treasure hunt have anything to do with a holiday or Dubai. So I think he'll be so shocked when he comes in. I don't even think he'll understand this. Like your prize is in the palm of your hand. So obviously the palm is to do with Dubai, but I don't think he'll have any idea. Honestly, I'm so excited. So I'm gonna set you guys up on a tripod and yeah, just wait for him to come home. I think he's on like his third clue. So he's got like three left to go, I think. The third one's here. Honestly, I I'm so nervous, but I'm so excited to finally tell him. Like, I've literally felt so sick the last week trying to keep it from him. Like, so many people know. He's the only one pretty much that doesn't know. So, I'm gonna <laughs> set you up on a tripod and film his reaction when he comes in. So, I'll see you guys in a minute. Right, we've got to the next place. Go and have a look, see if I can see it at the sign. Brandon's gonna go and have a little look, see if he can find it. We're on the, f this is our fourth one, I think now. Yeah, this will be our fourth. Got it. This is clue number four now. There we go. They're all birthday cards, by the way. It wasn't a mistake, but steak spent, spelt with the food. It wasn't a mistake that you spend most of your money where oh. the Easter Bunny used to live. But mistake is spelt yeah. with food. The White Rabbit, the Miller and yeah, Carter. Yeah, which is where Miller and Carter is. Yeah, uh, yeah. Miller and, the Miller and Carter near us used to be called the White Rabbit, which is obviously Rabbit Easter. She spelled it <coughs> like mistake with the word steak. Well, if it's at the door, should I go and check before I go? Surely it's there. Like loads of steak. Oh, I can't park there, so can't I'll pull here there, and so. have a little look at the restaurant door. It's not there either. Okay then. Is it over there, do you think? It was literally on, on the menu board thing. How did we not see that? You can't pole dance on this red and white pole, but a fade will give you a slam dunk. <laughs> Barbers? <laughs> I think so. A fade? Yeah, red and white pole is the barber thing. Yeah. Right, I'm going to my barbers. barbers. Oh, that's embarrassing. They're all working. Oh, that is embarrassing. Oh, they're going to be like, what are you doing here? Right, I'm we about are. I'm to, to my barbers. So... Oh, where is it? It's going to be in the barbers. Oh, that's so embarrassing. <laughs> Right, I'm going into the barbers, guys, one sec. Oh, they've given it to him. Oh, oh God, he's got it. Right, see you later. Right, see you later. Okay. Right, it's a clue. I've got the clue, guys. I'm not going to tell you, obviously, but it's basically, I think it's at our house. Let me know. I've been out for like an hour and a half by the time I've done all this. Right, I think it's going to be at our house, so let's see. There's got to be a present there or something. Otherwise, why would I be going home? I don't know. Because we weren't at home. We were at, obviously, parents. Now this is taking me back home. Right, we'll get back to you guys when we get there. Right, I'm assuming, I think Erin's back home. I don't know, I'm just gonna park outside <gasps> the house. There's something on the door. What? Congratulations, it says on the front door, congratulations, you only have 48 hours left to go. I what? actually don't know what that means. Congratulations, you only have 48 hours left to go. Ah, until the West Ham game on Thursday. It's Tuesday. Cool. Good luck. Your prize is in the palm of your hand. Your prize is, what? 
Whoa! 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 We're going to Dubai in two days. Yeah. We're going, We're going in two days. I'm not to be like happy or like not scared, but like what? Did you not get this? I was like, oh your prize is in the palm of your hand. And you've got 48 hours. You're going in two days. That you didn't even weird. see it. I know. Did you not even see I, it? No, I came in. I was like, is it just 24th or something? <laughs> what? You didn't even read it? No, it just only clicked on when you said to turn around. Oh my gosh. Oh my god. <laughs> I've been washing all your summer clothes. I cannot believe you didn't even notice it said Dubai. Honestly, when I first How you, could I, you miss it? I just thought this was a surprise, like a big sell. <laughs> oh my Which god. Which would have been good anyway. He was like, what is that sell? In oh, Dubai! <laughs> what the actual hell is going on? I, I don't even know what to do. Erin's just been saying to me, like, how did you not read Dubai when I walked in? Like, with this in front of me. Like, so I walked in, and my dad was trying to blow this cannon confetti thing off. And then all of a sudden, I turned around, and I was like, oh my god, it says Dubai. Like, I am over the moon, guys, can I just say, in case it doesn't look like I am. I'm just nervous to go on another flight and stuff with my whole anxiety and my throat thing. But I'm glad we're going, because me and Erin have been talking about Dubai for so long. And it's weird, because I was the one that always said, I want to take Erin into Dubai to witness the Atlantis Hotel, but she's taking me there. What the hell? I'm literally in shock. But yeah, we are on the way to Dubai on Friday. Oh my god, I don't even know what to what to say. Boarding parcelet, London Heathrow to Dubai, leaving the 6th of May, returning the 14th. Oh mate, this is just mental. She got me this bottle of aftershave, which is blooming expensive in itself. It's in Selfridges, but when we went once, when was it for your birthday? For Erin's birthday, I smelt this in there. She obviously took notes because I said I was going to get it, but she obviously surprised me a bit. Not that she needed to do anything else. Like, I feel so bad. How am I letting you pay for Dubai? <laughs> Mental. Well, you'll just get less for Christmas. I don't need anything for Christmas now. How long are we going for? Eight nights? Eight nights because I wanted to have a whole seven days because like, you get a bit jet lagged and stuff. So I didn't want to like, well, days traveling, I didn't want to have seven nights and then only have like six <clears> days. Do you know what I mean? Yeah. I've booked wow. you in a haircut as well because I know you booked me one. in a haircut. Like, Because I know you would be like, oh, I've got to have my hair Yeah, done. I need a haircut for holiday. Oh, mate, this is just mental. So guys, I didn't even get this hint either. Your prize is at the palm of your hand, as in the palm in Dubai. I can't believe you booked Atlantis out of all places. I know that's like the only place you'd want to go. Not the only place. I'd be happy going to Dubai no, and sleeping on the beach. You always talk about and you were like, oh, when you first go, I want you to go to the Atlantis. So. Yeah, I always said to Erin, if when we first go to Dubai, you've got to experience the Atlantis. Because for me, I've been to the Atlantis twice um, with my family when we, me and Holly were both younger. So we went. 2011 and 2013, both times we went to the Atlantis and it was just unbelievable. I'm buzzing because I've got 30 kg allowance. 30 kg, I mean you took 26 to Spain so you're going to need 50. So yeah, I'm gonna take a minute to comprehend what's just happened but yeah, we're going to the bar in two days. Hey guys, it is a bit later now. Still gobsmacked like. <laughs> Brandon knows about the whole surprise. If I sounded not as excited guys. I was just in shock. He didn't even this is I not, didn't even notice it said Dubai. He literally <laughs> thought the prize was just balloons and a cake. <laughs> Behind the door, Mick was there with a cannon. The cannon wouldn't pop. That's why I was so hoping. Brandon was just looking at Mick like he's trying to pop this cannon, it's not working. But anyway, Brandon thought that his prize was, was just that. the balloons and the cake. Like that's what he what his prize was. And Holly was like, read it, Brandon. He read it and he was like Dubai. And I was, I was like, like oh, how did you walk in that room and not see it said Dubai? <laughs> I was literally, I was so confused because you just sort of stood there. I was like, it just took me a while to process. Like, yeah. we're going to Dubai. When? Where? Where? What do I do? Like, yeah. when I get told stuff, like, with two days yeah. notice, it like makes But anyway, that was the reaction. Obviously, I'm very excited, guys. The only reason he wasn't sure at first is because he literally did not read it. Um, I literally, I, I opened the door. And I was just looking at the cannon, Dad trying to do it. Didn't even notice Dubai. I thought it just said 24th or something like that. <laughs> yeah, so that's the big surprise. We are going to Dubai Mate, you on lot Friday. you better watch out for the Dubai content on both Brandon's our channels. Brandon's going to be filming so much Dubai content. I'm uh, going to do a couple of vlogs, but Brandon's going to be doing a lot of filming. We're all going to be doing We're it, literally like, going to be doing so much TikTok, out there. It's just Insta. me and Brandon going. We are going on a Friday. Our flight's at 9 in the morning. And we are going for 8 nights. And we are just so excited. Oh, I'm sad dog. to leave Ernie Boy again, but... No, Boy. We've wanted to go for so long and I thought yeah, he no. he's so indecisive Brandon is no, And I thought if I don't anxious. book it, I was like if I don't book it then we're not gonna go So yeah, that is the surprise I hope you liked it. I hope you guys loved it. Ever, it Hope you enjoyed this video. Make sure you watch out for the Dubai
my vlogs. Jess, There's gonna be so much content. Ready to be active on every social media platform possible. Yes. But anyway, I love you all, and I'll see you guys in the brand new video on Saturday at 6 p.m. Bye.